You know, there's a story of Abu Bakr radiallahu anhumah that after Fajr every day, he'd walk out into the distance, you know, just within a desert, until he disappeared every single day during his Khalifa. So Umar radiallahu an sees that and he gets curious, as I think any one of us would, right? Where is he going every day? So one day Abu Umar followed him and kind of like did it in a, you know, hide behind a rock. Okay, I see him. I still have my eyes. Get a little closer. Till he saw Abu Bakr walk into a home of an elderly woman. And he went inside. He spent a few hours, not minutes, hours. Imagine, this is a Khalifa. This is the leader of the whole Ummah. And then he comes back out. And then he comes back in to the marketplace and takes care of the rest of the companions. So Umar radiallahu anh, walked into the same house afterwards and knocked the door. And when the elderly woman came, she was blind. So he asked her, who is this person that comes to you? She says, I don't know, but I heard that he is a gentle soul, a generous soul. So Umar radiallahu anh, asks him, well, asks, asks her, what does he come here and, and do every single day? He said he comes here, he tidies up the house, he takes care of the animals, he milks them, he prepares food for me, and he puts it to the side, and he makes sure that I have everything I need, and then he leaves. And Umar asks the elderly woman, you don't know who this person is? He says, no. He has chosen not to expose his name or his identity. And that's when Umar started to cry because he said, it's a secret deed that Abu Bakr is doing for Allah by taking care of and providing for someone with not a single companion having a clue what he was doing.